Hi, Superspheres here, back with another Realm Grinder video, episode 52, and you can see we're in Reincarnation 18, we have E77 gems, because the Sun Force upgrade is just so good when it, when it boosts the assist, seriously. It like, raises the cap from about E69 gems to about E78 gems, with mercenaries, so that's insane. And then what I'm also going to do is I'm actually is I'm going to I'm gonna go Elven Bloodline because I'm gonna to try to unlock more researches. Remember it, Oh no wrong 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 alignment. I'm trying to go goblins here. So I'm trying to unlock more researches, but they cost ridiculous amount of faction coins. This is why I'm going Elven Bloodline and going goblins, because these are the best factions and bloodlines to find faction coins. So I'm doing this to unlock more researches, so I did not do this last reincarnation, but I could. I think it went to like 153 or something. Now it goes to 171, and you can see it costs a lot of faction coins. The thing is that Goblin's Greed, for one, that gives a lot of faction coins, so that's a good initial boost to the faction I didn't even get any Halls of Legends. I probably should have gotten them because the, their upgrades are really good. And then... I can start purchasing some of the researches so that I can get even more faction coins. So for these, I'm just gonna get get them since there's like four or less. There's one research here that gives a ridiculous amount of faction coins. I don't know which one. It's gotta be gotta be something from the goblins, considering how uh, it has to be something that goblins can use. Well, it turns out that the two researches that boost faction coins, this one. And this one, they both- this one is, I think, undead only, and this one is goblins only, so I'm really surprised. Why would- why would- no, not goblin only. Oh my god. I, I can't speak. It's elf only. So, yeah, that's weird. I would expect- I mean, I know elves are good for faction coins, but I thought goblins are even better for faction coins than elves. Whatever, I'm just gonna- I'm, I'm going to go elves, so I, this time I can purchase the research that- I think this one's a little better for faction coins than the other one. So, and just a few tax collections, that'll give me the mercenary thingy. Yeah, I, I call it a thingy, because- And then, training gra yeah, probably get that one, what is this? No, just avoid that one. And then, get these, yeah, here, here's the one, it's- 4400% maybe it was a little better to get the other one, but whatever, they're they're both really powerful. And then there there's this, I can get these. Um, I don't have to worry about which ones I get here. Just honestly, just keep getting everything here except this one. Oh, here's another one that boosts faction coins, so since I have two of them that boost faction coins, that's going to be extremely easy faction coins. And I'm going to get everything else here. So yeah, I can see I can start purchasing these since I have now the, the coins. Also, I'm just gonna buy all these so I can get more, just everything. And then, I, I wonder how much this does. E7 faction coins per tax collection. I can cast like, I can cast a tax collection every like 1.6 seconds or something like that. So yeah, easy faction coins. And so this is gonna allow me to start um, getting these, so I, I can actually buy all, but I sort of want to do it like this. Okay, I'm, I don't quite have, have a lot of faction coins. I don't, I don't have enough faction coins. Even though I thought I had a lot of faction coins, I don't. Maybe if, maybe if I just, I, I, I do not have diamond pickaxe here, so just, yeah, just, honestly, just, just have this auto cast because it's really only faction coins that I'm going for. So glad that I don't need to excavate for faction coins. Like, there's better ways, like going into specific research builds. So, here's one at 150, and I've already unlocked it. I I wonder what it is. Oh, you have to get other researches to get it. So it's increase the production of the two highest buildings here, space and mana regen. Isn't that really weak? Actually, no. It buffs Heaven's Gates, so that's fine. And let's see if there's anything else. No, there's not. So. Craftsmanship, see if there's anything. There's something at 150 and I, that I got, but I can't get it here because, you know, I can only get four in each branch. So this production of all buildings based on the amount of research made. So this means, yeah, every time I get a research, it's going to buff that research thing. So it's interesting how they, how 
they require other researches to unlock. And here's one that I unlocked and I can use immediately. It's increased faction coin find chance even more. It's also, they're called advanced research. Whatever that is. Uh, that's probably just a name, but yeah, more faction coins. Like we needed any more. We, we have so much. This is, this is ridiculous. Let's see what it, we can do. I didn't even get this. I wonder if I even need this because, yeah, there's some new stuff I'm going to get. There's, there's actually two of them. Something here. Um, I need... What? Why is it 5% even though I have both researches? This is Craftsmanship 10, Craftsmanship 105. 10, 105. I have them. I don't have this. Do you have to have both of them on you? Or do they just, do they not give hints? I have no idea. There's, I got this one, which is, let's see, do I have both of these? Economics, 135, and, oh, well, I don't have it. I have it unlocked, but I, I maybe just need to go into certain factions. That's what it feels like. This is a production of all buildings thing. So, then Economics, 25. So, I guess I'm just going to get this one. This one's a little better. But why, why can't I get this one? Six percent. It's going up. There, there's a trophy, apothecary, and oh, it is one of the secret tropes. So I, I knew about these, or, or I, oh, I didn't know about them, but I guess that these had to do all with researches, and I would just get them eventually. So here's the first one of these: discover at least ten alchemy researches. So I don't know why they're under secret trophies, but whatever. This one I can get. It's, um, will empower heaven's gates. What? And then Alchemy 25. See, I don't have this one or this. It d doesn't even tell you what you're going for after you've done it. When you, whenever you cast a spell, the, the production of most productive building based on the amount of mana produced. Increase the production. Oh, I, I see. Mana produced in the game for 20 seconds. So it's based on mana regen. Another ca spell's cast with this effect is active. It is restored to its full duration. Okay, I see. Still, why don't I have this one? What am I going for? There's no clue, and it doesn't tell you afterward. Or maybe it's different since this is 145 instead of 150. Everything else is 150. And here's another thing I just automatically unlocked at 150. It's increased the production of all buildings based on assistance. That's actually a really powerful boost right here. So I think this, I mean, I know this is not the optimal build, but it seems really powerful. Like, really powerful. Let's see what. Once I, I actually start casting spells for production, see how powerful this is. This is still 7%. Is this just a, is this, is this just a time gate? I, I wonder if it is. I, I don't think it's quite just a time gate, but it could be. 416 Royal Exchanges. How many? It's actually not that much. I thought I had more Royal Exchanges than that. Um, whatever. The, the main regen, it's pretty fast, but it's, it's not quite as fast as I want it to be. Maybe I could just start casting the spells now because I'm lazy I don't, I don't want to wait the full time and because holy light only lasts 10 seconds so I can just do this and then get all these upgrades e75 gems so I thought I'd actually get a little more especially with all the tax collections it's only one order of magnitude of gems it's about the same amount I'll get with mercenaries so it's probably because I, I focused on faction coins when went elf bloodline like I definitely could have done better bloodlines for this can I wait I can get five in this branch hmm that must that must be based on the amount of researches you get in each branch interesting so I don't know what will empower heavens oh that that's probably what that effect does when you when you cast a spell it increases the heavens gates so currents I don't know I, I think just the word empowering was confusing me like what but Whatever, this thing is still at 7%. Is this based on buildings or something? Or spells? No, it can't be based on spells cast. It's based on assistance? I have no idea. I'm going to cast all the spells again just to see what, what this is going to do here. It's going to be a little weak at first, but once I get Holy Light going, actually I can probably do it right now and just spam tax collection. Let's see. It's E79, so it's a little stronger for that, but... Still wondering what this is. Now it says 8%. 
Okay, so I admit to looking up things a little bit. I mean, I just looked up um, two researches, this one and th that one, and turns out that none of the 150 ones actually have an additional requirement, but this one does have an additional requirement and it never tells you what it is. But from looking up, looking up, yes, I I'm guilty of doing that. I'll try not to do that. I didn't just follow a guide. Um, yeah, it's... It's cast a bunch of tax collections. Yay! I think it's 5,000 of them, and I don't even get one per second. I should probably change my build. I think that's exactly what I'm gonna do. But first, actually, I... I off camera, I actually got a bunch of these buildings trophies by pushing mercs very far for, like, the neutral buildings. I got, like, 2,500 of all the neutral buildings, so... I mean, that, that's pretty cool. But we're gonna, we're gonna see... We're just gonna try to make a build that will give us as much mana regen as possible. This means going Druid Bloodline, that's... Yeah. And... Remember, I, I can't believe that, that time I had like, 1700 mana regen, that was insane. Maybe we'll get that again. I feel like if I go... If I go Angels, which... Are automatically, they are, they already give you good mana regen, I feel like that... Is gonna help me... With, like, the researches. Unfortunately, Faction Coins are gonna be not as easy to get. So, also, the tax collections are cheaper, so, yeah, there's that. I'm just gonna get this just to get the basic, um, thing. Activate just to get the basic faction coins. I don't need, like, a crazy amount, just enough to get all the heritages and all that. And now you can see, just only cost 90 mana. I'm not, I haven't even gotten any researches yet, and it's, 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 it, yeah, everything's so cheap. And I think I can still, yes, I can get this, so actually really helpful so some of these are so this is a production but most of these other ones are like mana regen or max man mana so i feel like like this is based actually this is a really strong boost considering that heaven's domain is only 81.6 percent so actually i'm actually gonna get, get that one let's see there's i can actually get six of these but well there's six that are available this is mana regen so just get that automatically it's only four of these so just get all of them and then there's there's four of these if you don't include that one and i don't think i really need this is just faction coins so i may just skip out on it this is mana regen so get it this is offline production so skip it um hopefully i, I can i feel like I, I should just probably just use spiritual surge and call to arms just a bunch of spells just to, just so i can get some more coins this is mana regen so of course of course get this and then have to be careful here neutral buildings um no that doesn't seem very good this is faction coins i guess it's okay yeah i'll get that one because i guess more royal exchanges i don't know actually that might have been not been very good whatever i can get this and then what is this this is these are all just production production the last two are stronger so just get those um this is i don't know just get that that is, wait, is the neutral build? Like now it's and just all the good buildings are doing everything. Let's see, this is offline production, so skip it. This is product, just basic product. This is more assistance, which is really good. I feel like the, the you know, these two aren't very strong, so just get these these two here, and of course get this one. And yeah, now it's really just the the other good buildings. So we have, now we have 90 mana per second. Or not 90. We have a thousand mana per second. This is gonna allow us to easily reach this. I, I think it, sh it should be easy, and especially if I can get more of these researches. I don't think I really can, but whatever. This is actually it's not going up that quick. I did get a bunch of coins, however. So uh, yeah, there's that. This is, these are just production. So yeah, I'll just get this one. This one's slightly stronger. This one is production this one's also production so just get that this is mana regen so of course get that one 1400 per second now and then this is uh i, I guess get it because i think yeah, getting more buildings does i think increase max mana which increases mana regen and then here i i can choose between this one and this one the 150 is definitely stronger so i'll get that one this is max mana which it's gonna give me a, a mana per second. Yeah, we're back up to 1,700 mana per second. It's crazy. I I can't I can't believe this. Actually, I, I feel like 
since we have so much mana per second, we can just you can just cast all these spells, and then yeah, now we can get, afford everything. So this is gonna actually this will help everything, it's production and faction coin chance, and uh, yeah, there's this as well. So that's gonna help us get more gems, even though we're only as E72. It's not really E73, so I guess it's a little better after purchasing some of the upgrades that I probably missed for a little bit too long, but. You can just see how, yep, like this is crazy, E75 gems, and if we go here, how close are we, 44%, yeah, it's, 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 it's a little bit of a time wall, but it's not that bad, so I'm just gonna wait out. Okay, we're not done yet, but, um, there's actually, this, this is apparently a bug, this is not intentional, that this, there's no, that, that, there's no clue, like, I, I think it used to, they used to not have clues, but a recent update, um, brought the clues in and I guess they just forgot this research so yeah so it's, it's a bug in realm grinder it's probably the first bug I've seen it's not a real it's not a major bug it's just a missing clue it doesn't even affect gameplay at all because technically it's just text and that doesn't actually affect how the game works we're almost up to 2,000 mana per second we're cast how many tax collections are we casting every second it, it's it's, it's ridiculous. We're, it's well over 20 per second. So, yeah, it's a lot of spells cast. It, I remember the Drow unlock, 10,000 spells cast. Now that takes just, un, it takes like 8 minutes now with this mana per second. And we only need 5,000 of these. So, yeah, we're, we're going to get there real soon. Okay, we have unlocked the new research. And what does this do? It's increased... Yeah, the progress is 5,000 tax collections. Increased tax collection were a reward by 30 seconds worth of production. So this essentially doubles the effect in effectiveness of tax collection. So, yeah, as if that spell wasn't OP enough with this crazy mana regen. So, yeah, there, there's that. We're, we're just, I'm just going to cast all the spells just to see. And then just, yeah, like tax collection like this. It's... It, the mana regen is so good that it's like I could I could literally af afford like to just to literally just do cast this spell again while while it's going because it's just yeah it, it's just that OP so it's actually not a very OP build for production however this does increase our gems but not by that much it's only by 4e79, which that that's a, that, that about triples our gems, so I, I guess that's good, but it's not it's not the um it's n not bringing us to the end of the reincarnation. But there's other things to do in this reincarnation that I have not done yet. We'll get to that next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out. <laughs>